morning, my friends, my Facebook friends in America and around the world. Uh, I'm back with you today and would like to share what has been done the last several weeks. And we're working on the Big Bible, God's Holy Word. He's a mighty God. He's the living God. And He is faithful. He is faithful to a thousand generations. He never sleeps, he never slumbers, and he takes care of his own. We're glad you joined us. We have been working on the Big Bible, and I've got several pieces put up. More is ready to assemble, and we're working on it daily, and I would like to share that with you today. Many of the Facebook friends ask, how it's done and how it's coming. I appreciate that interest that you have because the Word of God, the Holy Word of God, is one of the most precious books that you can ever hold in your hand, read, and learn of God. Okay? Um, here is the Bible. Each one of these are pages. This is page one on one side, page two on the other, page three on one side, page four on the other, page five on one side, page six on this side, page seven on this side, page eight here. And then we go into Genesis and page uh, nine here, and here's where Exodus starts. This is Genesis, now we're starting Exodus. Okay, through the typical first of the fourth chapter, page 10. Page 11, page 12, page 13, and page 14. Okay? Now, these, this is what I call lifting up the Word of God. Not just laying a book on the table, but lifting up God's holy word that the world may know and see the Word of God is the most precious thing that we possess. Now, I've got two rolls that I would like to show you. Uh, in making this Bible, I do it by canvas, and it's a uh, 36 foot, uh, 18 rolls, 7 half feet long. So this is what the pages look like before I lift them up on phone board. So we write them, and God's word is in red. We serve a holy God. He's a mighty God. He is everlasting and he is faithful. And so this, this goes on. It goes, uh, it goes seven and a half feet long, 73 feet uh, high at six foot. So I just wanted to show you, many of you are interested and how I put it together, and how we write it. Every word is holy and precious. We make sure every I is dotted, every T is crossed. For this is God's holy word. And like we told you before, God wrote the Ten Commandments with his own finger. Okay, now then, I have said this, this is several more panels that will be going up and will be adding to what we already have. Now, you wonder sometimes, are you making a page? Yes. I make a page for God's Word. This is canvas. In the rows that I get, they're 18 feet long. So here's how I do it. This panel, one page, is 900 lines uh, together. So this is how I work on the Big Bible. See the lines? I first paint it in white to lay God's holy word on. Then I paint the surrounding around it, all of it. Then I draw the lines. This has 900 lines. Then once we get the lines drawn, we start writing. I'm almost through with Leviticus. What you see in 
behind me is two books of the Bible. And before it's over, there'll be 66 books of the Bible, God's holy word. It's precious. One of the greatest things could ever happen to man on earth is to know what God says. It's glorious. It's wonderful. It's comforting. It will guide you. It will lead you. It will show you what you need to do in your world. And it applies to all of us. I was back over here on the back side, going down the back side of these. And on this page, God told Noah, you remember, it was after the flood. He told Noah, he says, multiply and replenish the earth. Then I counted the pages, page one, page two, and page three on the big Bible. On page three, there they were, all the 12 tribes of Israel. Now I'm saying that for one thing, be patient. No God is in control in every situation. And if God told Noah to replenish the earth, then he knew Abraham, Isaac, Jacob. And on page 30, just three pages down, there would be the 12 tribes of Israel. God's faithful. He is with the children of men to perform his will to love them, to care for them, because he has a place prepared for those who love him. Okay, so now I've showed you some of it. This, we got 65 more books, so it's going to be quite large. One day we'll have it on display, and you'll be able to come and see it. But right now, we are compiling it. We're putting it together. We are writing it. And we love every minute of it. For God's presence is almighty. He is the almighty God, Jehovah Jireh. He's the lily of the valley, the bright morning star, the beautiful rose of Sharon, the king of kings, the lord of lords, the lord of hosts. Yes, he's the lord of hosts, the angels. And then he is the almighty God. He's the mighty God. He's Jehovah He's Jehovah Jireh, the provider for the children of men on the earth. And all he asks us to do is to live for him and obey him. Nothing will he withhold from them who walk uprightly before him. No weapon that is formed against you shall prosper, child of God. God will put a shield around you and protect you. God loves his people. Okay, now then, I'm going to uh, take the video and I'm going to show you a little bit closer view. And I would like to t maybe show you around to the side of it so you'll see this is uh, our living room. And I'm working here in our home right now. Uh, but you can see it's getting larger and larger. Don't forget, there are seven and one half feet long and 73 inches, six foot one inch tall. Okay, we enjoyed being with you today, but let me take the video. I'll show you a little bit closer view of it, okay? In order to have a place to put it, now, I wanted to show you, everything is on rollers. Now, if you saw this side, you would see page one or the index page. And then everything is on rollers. See how they're on rollers? Everyone moves on its own. Okay? All the pages are written. Okay? Page 5 and page 6. Page 7 and page 8. Page 9 and page 10. Page 11 
And there, right down there is where the 12 tribes of Israel are. And 12. Okay, that's where they are. And then the last one that I have compiled is page 13 and page 14. Now, let me come on this side so you can see what it looks like as a whole page. Okay? There we go. Okay. It has two, four, six different uh, uh, paintings on it. So this is the Word of God. God is talking, so I write it in red. Okay, now I'm coming to the other side of it. See, it's all alike just down in there. Here's the Ten Commandments. You remember I made that with the, with the rock. And then here is the children of Israel, all 12 of them. And they are, I have put them inside the Bible that I have written. Okay? Okay, and I'm getting right down here to the one I'd like to show you. And God blessed Noah and his sons and said unto them, Be fruitful and multiply and replenish the earth. Okay? This one is the states and where God divided the earth. Okay? All right. Now then you're seeing how I've put them together and on page one, page two, and page three. They obey God, replenish the earth. The 12 tribes of Israel are shown on this page. Okay? The Ten Commandments also was in Exodus. Okay? And so there you're seeing now. I just wanted to share with you that, that goes along that side of there. I have them all compiled. Everything's on rollers. You can move each panel and each scripture, and one day I'll have them all on display, and you'll be able to see the entire one, entire Bible, 66 books in the Bible. Okay, God bless you, my Facebook friend, and we look forward to showing you more as we work. God bless Take care, be faithful because God will be faithful to you.